Nuclear weapons. The very words conjure up images of immense power and destruction, of a weapon so devastating that it has the potential to wipe out entire cities in an instant. But beyond the devastation lies a fascinating history, a world of covert operations, cutting edge technology, and international power struggles. Do you want to know more about the development of these weapons and the technology behind them? Or perhaps you're more interested in the effects of a nuclear explosion? From land-based missiles to submarines, the location of these weapons is a carefully guarded secret. We will discover the world of nuclear weapons. History and Development of Nuclear Weapons Did you know that the development of nuclear weapons began long before World War II and has a fascinating history filled with secret missions and covert operations? A nuclear bomb is a devastating weapon that derives its power from nuclear reactions. The United States developed the first nuclear bombs during World War II as a means of ending the war with Japan. This top secret research and development program, known as the Manhattan Project, was aimed at creating the world's first nuclear weapon. In July 1945, the bomb was successfully tested. Subsequently, two nuclear bombs were dropped on the Japanese cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki, resulting in the deaths of an estimated 200,000 people. Since then, several countries have developed and maintained nuclear weapons for various reasons, including deterrence, defense, and political power. During the Cold War, the United States and the Soviet Union engaged in a nuclear arms race, as both countries sought to develop more potent and sophisticated nuclear weapons. Today, numerous countries possess nuclear weapons, and the threat of nuclear war remains a significant concern for global security. How do nuclear weapons work? Ever wanted to know how scientists and engineers managed to harness the power of the atom to create the world's most devastating weapon? Nuclear weapons use nuclear reactions to create massive explosions. There are two types, fission bombs, which split the nucleus of an atom, and fusion bombs, which combine atomic nuclei. Fission bombs use highly radioactive material and conventional explosives to compress the material, causing atomic nuclei to split and release energy. Fusion bombs use a fission bomb to initiate a fusion reaction, which combines hydrogen isotopes and releases more energy than fission. Creating a functional nuclear weapon is complex and requires advanced knowledge and precise design, testing, and manufacturing. Governments tightly control nuclear weapon designs and construction to prevent their proliferation and catastrophic consequences for global security. Range and Damage What would happen if a nuclear bomb were to explode in your city? Would you know what to do in the aftermath? The range and damage caused by a nuclear weapon depend on various factors, including the weapon's size and yield, detonation altitude, and surrounding terrain. A large nuclear bomb detonated at a high altitude can cause extensive damage over a vast area, including a potent electromagnetic pulse that can damage or destroy electronic devices. Furthermore, a nuclear detonation can release substantial amounts of radioactive fallout, leading to long-term health effects and environmental contamination. Due to their devastating consequences and potential for catastrophic outcomes, the use of nuclear weapons is widely considered to be a last resort. Effects of a nuclear explosion If you think the explosion of a nuclear bomb is the only danger, think again. From radiation sickness to EMPs, the effects of a nuclear explosion are far-reaching and long-lasting. Following a nuclear explosion, immediate and long-term effects are observed on the environment and living organisms. These effects vary depending on the explosion's size, yield, altitude, location, and prevailing weather conditions at the time. Immediate effects of a nuclear explosion include a blinding flash of light and intense heat a supersonic shockwave that damages buildings and infrastructure in the explosion's proximity, and a massive burst of radiation. Exposure to radiation can cause acute health effects, such as burns, radiation sickness, and an increased risk of cancer. The radiation effects can continue to persist in the days and weeks following the explosion. The radioactive debris known as fallout, released into the atmosphere by the explosion, can contaminate the environment and cause long-term health effects, including cancer, genetic mutations, and other severe health issues. Apart from the physical effects, a nuclear explosion can lead to psychological and societal impacts. The use of nuclear weapons can instill widespread fear and anxiety, political instability, and tension between nations. In the long run, a nuclear explosion can disrupt food and water supplies, harm the environment and ecosystems dependent on it. Control and Launch of Nuclear Weapons Who has the power to launch a nuclear weapon, and how do they make sure it doesn't fall into the wrong hands? The control and launching of nuclear weapons involves multiple layers of security and oversight, including secure storage and maintenance, authorization and verification, and transmission of the launch order. 
Nuclear weapons are launched using delivery systems such as missiles, bombers, or submarines. Guidance systems ensure accuracy and safety features prevent accidental detonation or unauthorized use. Unique Features of Nuclear Weapons What makes nuclear weapons so unique, and why have they been at the center of global power struggles for decades? Nuclear weapons differ significantly from conventional bombs in terms of their destructive power and impact. Unlike conventional bombs, which rely on the chemical reaction of explosive materials to create an explosion, nuclear weapons can release an explosive yield equivalent to tens or hundreds of thousands of tons of TNT, resulting in an unprecedented level of destruction. Unprecedented Destructive Power Nuclear weapons yield much greater explosive power than conventional bombs. Radiation Effects Nuclear explosions release high levels of ionizing radiation, causing severe damage to living organisms and the environment. Long-lasting effects. Radiation effects of nuclear weapons can persist for years or even decades. Strategic implications. Nuclear weapons are used as a deterrent against other nuclear armed states or as a symbol of national prestige and military strength. Countries with nuclear weapons. Which countries have nuclear weapons and where are they hiding them? Several countries possess nuclear weapons, including the US, the first to develop and use them, Russia with one of the largest arsenals, China, steadily expanding its arsenal, France and the UK, both using their arsenals as deterrent, and India and Pakistan, both steadily expanding their capabilities. North Korea has developed nuclear weapons despite opposition and sanctions. Russia putting nuclear weapons in Belarus. From land-based missiles to submarines, the deployment of nuclear weapons is a carefully guarded secret. But could they be closer than you think? There are serious concerns about the proliferation of nuclear weapons in other countries, including Iran. With regard to the possibility of Russia placing nuclear weapons in Belarus, there is currently no confirmed evidence to suggest that Russia has done so. However, Belarus is a close ally of Russia and a member of the Russian-led Collective Security Treaty Organization. As part of this alliance, Belarus has allowed Russia to establish military bases and deploy troops on its territory which has raised concerns in the West about the potential for a Russian military buildup in the region. Deployment of Nuclear Weapons With the threat of nuclear war always looming, how have nuclear weapons played a role in past conflicts and what does the future hold? Several countries are known to possess nuclear weapons and are believed to have deployed them at different locations. The deployment of nuclear weapons is regulated by international treaties and agreements, such as the Non-Proliferation Treaty NPT, and the Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty START which impose limits on the number of nuclear weapons that countries can possess and deploy. These agreements are subject to regular review and renegotiation. It's crucial to note that the use of nuclear weapons is considered a last resort due to their catastrophic impact on the environment and human life. As a result, most countries that possess nuclear weapons maintain a no first use policy and have implemented stringent protocols and safeguards to control and handle nuclear weapons. Role of Nuclear Weapons in Conflicts the Tsar Bomba, a hydrogen bomb developed by the Soviet Union in 1961, remains the most powerful nuclear weapon ever tested. It had a yield of 50 megatons of TNT, which is equivalent to 50 million tons of TNT. While the Russian RDS-220, or Tsar Bomba, variant is currently the most powerful nuclear weapon in terms of yield, with around 100 megatons of TNT, it is not believed to be deployed by Russia as it is too large to be delivered by any existing missile or bomber aircraft. The most powerful nuclear weapon currently deployed by a country is believed to be the Russian RS-28 Sarmat, an intercontinental ballistic missile ICBM, capable of carrying up to 16 nuclear warheads. Although the exact yield of the warheads is unknown, they are estimated to have a total yield of around 50 to 60 megatons of TNT. Potential for nuclear weapons in Ukraine-Russia conflict with the threat of nuclear war always looming, how have nuclear weapons played a role in past conflicts and what does the future hold? The threat of nuclear weapons has been a concern in various conflicts throughout history, including the Cold War between the United States and the Soviet Union, and the ongoing tensions between North Korea and the international community. However, most countries with nuclear weapons maintain a policy of deterrence, using their nuclear arsenals as a means of preventing other countries from launching an attack. As for the ongoing conflict between Ukraine and Russia, the use of nuclear weapons is highly unlikely due to the catastrophic consequences it would have for both sides and the rest of the world. The conflict must be resolved peacefully, without resorting to military force to avoid any further escalation of the situation.
Nuclear weapons are a complex and often terrifying topic, but one that is important for us to understand. As we've explored the history, technology, and politics behind these weapons, we've seen the immense power they hold and the devastating effects they can have. But beyond the destruction, there is hope. Hope that we can learn from the past and work towards a future where nuclear weapons are no longer a threat. Hope that we can come together as a global community and build a world that is safe and secure for everyone. And with that said, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you in the next video.